Hey guys, it's me, Vixon D3. Welcome back to How to Minecraft. Another day, another episode, and today is a good day. Got a pretty cool plan for today's episode set out ahead of me. We are going to be using items from this chest right here. So, uh, people on the live stream, you can try and work out what is it, what it is we're going to be doing today. If you're watching on YouTube, you probably already know what we're doing because it's probably in the title. And uh, I did miss the episode yesterday, so I'm sorry for that. But in the same way, I'm not too sorry because I wasn't physically at home to stream um, and record. I was out for most of the day. So uh, hopefully that's all good. I'm not sure if I am going to continue the series every single day. I may drop it to every other day or just miss days here and there um, moving forward just to allow me to work on other content, that kind of thing. But if you are watching this on YouTube right now, um, leave a like correct if you do want me to keep this strictly daily. And I'll kind of judge how many likes we get as how much people you know really want to see the series daily. Um, if you're watching on Twitch, it'll be up on YouTube later tonight if you're wondering. So uh, like rating is appreciated. You know, um, if we get over, you know, over 30,000 or so, um, I'll definitely try my best to keep it as daily as possible. So uh, with that said, we are going to be grabbing ourselves some gold blocks. Actually, before we grab that, we have uh, a bunch of levels from the uh, grinder. I was mainly focusing gold pickups. As you see, we are pretty rich man swag down these parts. I did need to stop start it a few times. I wasn't focusing on getting XP. I did get a fair bit extra. Um, to start with, we're probably just going to just, just drop in some nice juicy leveled enchant. This is my materials chest. Let's grab some lapis from there. Just grab 18 fresh. Let's grab some books. They're the easiest thing to enchant. I have spare boots and chest plate. I really need to get some new depth threaded good boots in my life. So those are going to be key to enchant. Swords I'm pretty much fine for. I have a sharpness trade. So I don't need to worry about that. So I think this is the main stuff we're going to be enchanting here today. So uh, a lot of people guessing building on the casino with the gold blocks. Not what we're up to today. Um, prop 3, no thanks. Respiration 2, eh. I'm breaking three. Could come with Depth Strider. Honestly, I'll take Respiration 2 and something else, maybe. Lock of the Sea 2. That's decent. That's decent. I'll take it. Lure 3, tempting. Prop 4, tempting. I'm breaking 3 again. Prop 4, you can't get much better. Maybe I'll get I'm breaking 2. Perfect. That's a good, solid chest plate. Protection 3, no thanks. Sharpness 3, not too keen on either. Thorns 1, not particularly keen on. I'm tempted just to burn a level. Um, I could just do that right now. I can hear zombies walking around with my villager, dude. Oh, wait, was it this really prop three? Wow, that's poor. Um, you know, I'm just going to burn a level because it doesn't really matter. I just th even throw out the power one book. I don't even want it. Efficiency three is all right. Feather falling four, that is good. And maybe something else. Projectile four. I guess if I'm going into some sort of bow challenge, that'd be useful. Knockback two, not very good. I think I'm just going to burn another book here because I can do three more enchants even after burning this. Mm -hmm. That's the problem with books. You don't really get to choose. Um, like Affinity one, that's got to come with something else. 30 levels for, well, I guess three levels for Aquafinity 1. Oh, wait, can you get better than Aquafinity 1? I'm not sure you even can. Knockback 2 again. This kind of sucks. I'll just take it anyway. You never know. I think that's the most knockback you can get. Wait, why are you not? Oh, I'm out of lapis. Wow. I never thought I would actually run out of lapis. Enchanting. That just shows how many levels we had right there. So that's all good. In fact, I don't even want the power one, though. Did I pick that back up? Get out of here. Um, Aqua Affinity. How can I check if you can get better Aqua Affinity? I could go into a... Uh, to a, what do you call it? I should have actually looked at what the last enchant was, you know. Let's get let's get a bunch of this and I'll store this bear in the chest that we'll be ready to go next time. I'm not sure what even the level 30 enchant was down here, but we'll find out, we'll find out. I should have looked, definitely. And we get Blast Protection 4, I'll take it. Does it come with anything else? No. Nope. I mean, it's good just to have a variety of enchants, so that's XP coming in well from the old gold farm, but the gold being the main pickup for today. And uh, we are going to get to work with that right now. So, let's store this in materials. We're going to need the TNT. We're going to need three stacks of, uh, of gold blocks. Can leave that spare there. We are going to need an efficiency five pickaxe. Silk touch, is, silk touch is all good with me. We are also going to need, I guess, redstone torch for ignition. Um, what else are we going to need? I'm just trying to think here. We're going to need a beacon, of course. That's giving it away to all the stream viewers. We are indeed going to do some haste to mining, so... I'm just going to scoop up this for now. I will replace it once we are done with today's activities, of course. Um, but for now, we'll need a beacon. We're going to pile that up to uh, to haste two with 160 gold blocks, I want to say. So we're going to clear out some space to do that. And then when you have efficiency five in haste two, it's the equivalent of mining netherrack in the nether. So that's some crazy, crazy mining. Here's a little sneak peek of a future challenge video. Would you look at all of that? A future challenge video. Any guesses to what it could be? 
Well, you guys can let me know all about that. But without further ado, I guess it's time to get down to the depths and uh, get to go with uh, some haste mining. This is the first time I've ever done this in Minecraft, something I've wanted to do for a while. I should definitely clear out my inventory as well. Should definitely do that. Uh, let's throw these in there. They can just go in there. Um, we'll leave the books behind. And uh, I've been told it's good to bring... Is it good to bring chests? Honestly, honestly, I'll just throw out any surplus stone, so I don't... I'm not too bad about that. I guess wood's just always smart to bring, just in case you need to make anything down there. Water bucket going to be quite key, because there'll probably be a lot of lava. Flint and steel, honestly, going to leave behind. And also the uh, spare chicken, leave that behind. I think we have everything we're going to need for uh, heading out. If you know I've forgotten anything, let me know, stream. I can reuse the same beacon, I'm pretty sure. Don't quote me on that, though. So I guess it's time to get down to depth first. Damn it, don't have a minecart here. Let's work our way down. Now, the TNT is is picked up because to do to set up a maximum level beacon, you need to do a uh, you need to do a 9x9 nine nine pyramid. And that's, like, quite a lot of space to clear out. I mean, it doesn't sound like a huge amount, but that's, like, you know, 90 blocks. You need to do, like, four or five levels. So that's... It gets into the hundreds of blocks. So the options are to... Uh, one option is to, uh, look at this peasant of a gold farm. You did nothing for me. You got me like seven nuggets a year. Um, so the options are to, uh, it's tempting, honestly. I mean, how much space do we have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So honestly, in this space here, I could almost fit a, uh, a full, fully powered up beacon. And you know, honestly, I think I'm going to go for that because it means that I can tear apart, you know, this surrounding space. It's not ideal in a ravine, but, you know, we can we can test it out here. And, uh, you know, I think I'm going to blast out these corners a little bit just to uh, give us extra space to work with. So let's uh, do a bit of this. This is dangerous. Do not try this at home. Look at me go. I'm crazy. I don't play by the rules. Let's just take, blast that out a bit. There we go. Space created. Space created. Move, move, move. What can I clear out of my inventory space for now? Let's clear that out. Um, that'll do for that side. Just make sure it's still lit up. Um, this is the first time I've really done this, so I'm looking for my stream viewers for uh, help and advice along the way. Um, that would be nice. All right, let's clear out that side a bit more. Just gives us a bit more space to play with. Um, obviously, the pyramid is going to kind of taper in towards the middle, but um, that's all good. So we start here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That looks good to me. That looks good to me, honestly. Just clear out a little bit of space. We have work around space. So let's start. Let's start it. Yeah, sure, there. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. The rich man swagger on these blocks right now. All right, let's, uh, let's square this off, just like so. Let's fill it in and then get to go. That doesn't... Uh, I could have left that there, actually. Jeez, the usage. This looks so cool. This just looks cool. I've honestly never done this in Minecraft. In all my time of Minecrafting, I've never attempted something like this. So it should be interesting to see how it goes. And obviously, there's a huge setup time involved in this, especially if you have to clear out the space yourself. But when I'm doing it um, in an already cleared space... It should be fairly good. I'm not too worried about the fact that a lot of this is kind of mined around and about. I'm more interested in just seeing how it goes. And honestly, we're going to be mining stuff so fast. I don't think it really matters a huge amount. When I misplace, I can actually just leave them. It's good, though. It's the first level that takes a ton of ton of gold. And then these later ones actually don't require much at all. Just got to make sure I fill it all in. That's uh, the main thing. It's, it's so nice having gold. is just, you know, a go-to resource. We've just got plenty of it. And there's one more level, and that's it. This is, I believe, a max power... Max power beacon. Uh, I think I'm going to need some gold just to power it up the first thing. So there we go. Would you look at that? So I can put in... Hold on. Did I do something wrong? Oh, no, I didn't. Jeez, I worried then. So haste. Can you not get haste? Wait. You can get haste too, right? Secondary power. Regen. Please don't tell me you need a new beacon. What do you reckon? Oh, no. Does it need to be a beacon that's been programmed for haste rather than regen? I think I programmed them... Oh, wait. Hold up. Or do you need to get haste one before you... Uh-oh. No, please don't tell me I need a brand new... It needs sunlight? Oh, apparently it needs sunlight. That is something I did not know. 
It definitely needs some... Oh, snap. Okay. Okay, then. We just created ourselves an interesting situation. Ah! Okay, I should have dug down to place it then. All right. All right, let me write this down in the chat. Minus one, two, one, one. One, four, four, seven. We're gonna have to go to the surface and dig down then to that. All right. Jeez, I did not know. Well, the more you know. How, is it just the middle? I'm pretty sure it's just the middle of the beacon. Yeah, it, it could only be the beacon. Please don't tell me. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. All right, there we go. Well, we just learned something there. Um, that it's probably easier to mine down than mine up, honestly. Yeah, it's way easier. Um, and this actually continues straight to the surface, so that's all good. That's all good. Um, well, there we go. This is another reason I'm glad I streamed this series. It's always awesome to have help from you all. All right, let's just top up like this and continue this going. I don't know why I ever broke it off. I just wasn't, I think, oh wait, is that really the surface there? It's not as far down as it looks, you know? All right, let's uh, let's seal that up so it's top secret, top secret. Don't want anyone intersecting our system. Okay, so what were the coordinates? Minus 12, please don't be in water. Minus 12, 11, I don't think it'll be in water. Uh, minus, yeah, 12, 11. And one four four seven. One four four seven being this way. It's here. Minus twelve eleven one four four seven. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm being a yoloist. In before there's like a mini lava source here. In B four. There's just a tiny little. That's real unfortunate, isn't it? <laughs> it, it would be. It would be in the middle of my uh, train line. Oh well, we'll get over it. I'm gonna drop onto the wooden deck in a second, which should be fine. There we go. I ain't, I ain't afraid of no falling damage. Hey, and there we go. Although it's still not giving me the option for haste. Aha, haste two. Could you not, skeleton? Could you not? Wow, mobs just came in out of nowhere. Did I even get that? Haste 2. Haste 2. All right, here we go, guys. Moment of truth. Cheers to the little pointer on uh, how to set it up. Wow, this is quite something. I don't know why I'm filling in that space there. Well, wall, be gone. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. If diamond exists anywhere down here, we are on our way to find it real fast. Jeez, this is quite something. This is quite something. This is like strip mining on another level. Is it best to go and like, boom, there we go. We found it just like that. You've got to be extra careful. That'd be so easy to dig like three blocks under the diamond and just hit lava. Boom, we already found diamond. This could be the new thing. You know what? I just get a backpack with a beacon in it and I carry it around. I get my horses to tow it around. How much range do you get on this as well? You get tons of range. Um, yeah, I need to keep it lit up, but honestly, it's so fast. I'm just like, do I even need to? Wow. Well, I, well, no, it's not a question of do I even need to. It's just like, can I even be bothered to? Look at this. Just, just diamond. Just straight diamond. Oh, my. The range of this thing is crazy. It's all the way back there, and we're just out here. We can do this in a full circumference. We can take it to a new area. We gonna have all the diamonds. And diamond is the one thing on this game that can't be farmed. You can farm every other material, but you can't farm farm diamond. The only way you can get it is by mining for it. And this is probably the most efficient way of mining it I've ever encountered. It is wrecking through my pickaxe. But I, do we have a trade for efficiency five these days? I think we might do. I'm not even sure if we do or not. Look at this. This is amazing. Um, right, let's just keep going. Where those diamonds at. And the thing is, you could layer this down as well. Like, it's so fast. It's kind, of, it's kind of absurd. Like, how much diamond do I have? I already have 10 ore. In literally minutes. And as long as you avoid those patches of dirt, you are just well onto it here. Oh my gosh. This would be such an awesome way to, like, if you, if you ever needed to clear space for, like, an underground farm... Should be so easy to do this. I need to make sure I have at least a stacking of everything. Yeah, I've got, have I got stacks of iron as well? Yeah, so anything that I pick up that's not stone will get picked up. I mean, if I wanted to collect stone as well, this would be a great way to do it. Um, 
Yeah, I have um, I have um, uh, I have sharpness, sharpness, but efficiency five. All I need is on breaking three as a trade, which is uh, something definitely to keep in mind. But I am honestly blown away at how good this is. This is just, it's just easy. I could sit here and mine like this all day for days. For days, you got any more diamond? Maybe out this way. My diamond sensor tells me this way. We're going to burn through this pickaxe fast, though, like, in this session. But, honestly, if you're strip mining, you're going to burn through it anyway. This would be a really good way to dig, like, tunnels just to blast mine as well. Although, it would almost be too fast. Oh, hey, buddy. Like, look, I found some strip mine here. Like, do, do I care? No, I'll just keep going. Wow. Thing is, everything has, like... A lot of stuff around here, these parts, has been mined, but... I'm surprised I've not found more diamond, actually. Just makes you appreciate how rare it is. We've torn back through the ravine here. We're just carving through the sides of it. If there's any diamond around here, it shall soon be ours. Oh, wow, we've run out of food. Does, does food get used faster on... Uh... Does food get used faster when you're using haste? I don't even know. I'm going to try this side. Try my luck. Did strike 10 diamonds real quick on that side there. I think I dug some strip mines out this way just while I was AFKing once. Well, not. I wasn't AFKing while I was just playing off camera once. So we might strike into those. Uh, with any luck. Um, lava. That's no problem. Let's just jump over that. I want to get to 20, uh, I want to get to 20 diamond ore. That is the aim. I should probably get rid of that because it would be very easy to fall into when I'm going as fast as I am. Does water even flow faster? Let me see this. Water flows faster when there's haste. Crazy. Like, what other, is there any other cool stuff you can do with, uh, there we go, some more diamond. Is there any other cool stuff you can do with, uh, haste? Uh, anyone in the stream knows? It looks like that's where I was doing my strip mining. Um... A lot of people saying just do the mining with an iron pickaxe. Um, don't waste this. Thing is, I can trade, like, just emeralds, which I can farm, for the enchants to get this, the efficiency 5. Not the unbreaking 3, but the efficiency 5. So, it's, you know, not too expensive, and iron would be considerably slow. Look at this haste. It just still lasts out to here. Um, so, honestly, it's worth using this. Oh, is the haste gone? So, we're out of haste range, then we get back to here, and we, are we back in it? Haste plus. There we go. We're back in it. So yeah, mining just got a lot more interesting on the server. I can gamble away more to my heart's content. Um, although, anything that's not um, not a stone is noticeably slower. These are some of the strip mines that I've made. I mean, would just doing this in a strip mine be a better way to do it? If you sprint it along. Look at that, some more diamond. It's an easy game, easy life. How much are we up to now? 19, one more. We're back here. I mean, does this mine faster than I can run? Jeez, this pickaxe is nearly over. I'm going to stop before it's over just in case I can heal it. But let's see. Actually, maybe strip mining is the way to go. And then you run down the strip mines and just check. That's definitely getting the most surface area. Maybe if I was to do like... The next time I do it... Oops, that's no good. If I was to do like... A, I don't even need gold. If I was to do like a uniform strip mine, if that makes any sense. If I did like a grid pattern and just ran up and down it and did it real quick. And I think it's... Is it 100 by 100 or an 81 by 81 radius? If I just sprint down here, thing is I'd be more likely to run into lava if I surfaced it. If I surfaced it, if that made sense. Oh, and there we go. Boom. I'm not even, you know, I'm not even worried about losing the diamond to lava now. It's, just, it's so easy. Diamond just became easy. Look at that. 25, 27 diamond. Wow. It's just easy. Look at this. Have we still got haste? We have. It's just so fast. It's just so damn fast. Although, yeah, I know you guys can't see anything when it darkens out to my eyes can barely can but yeah i think i'm gonna see if i i'm gonna go up oh, fortune all of this diamond oops that would not be good i think i dipped down didn't i so um there we go we're back here and wow you even swing your sword faster look at that can you can you load bows faster no nah, it doesn't feel like it's any faster but look at that look at this look how fast i'm gonna carve up this creeper Actually, is it any actually faster? I'm not sure it's actually faster. Yo, is he running? No, he was running from the creeper. He doesn't run fast. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of this lava. But there we go. That's that's a new thing. As far as Minecraft goes for me. Some decent levels. Two levels, basically. 
Am I going to leave the beacon down here? I may honestly leave it down here and just do some more kind of crazy mining. That is how the old uh, gold farm works. But yeah, this is how the old pigman farm works. They spawn there, drop in, go like that. But we can tell the new gold farm when it creates that is a little more awesome. In before, somebody falls. They're looking at the beacons thing from, from the surface. In before, they just fall in and just get wrecked. Um, yeah, we're not going to be using this mine shaft for a little little while. All right, anyway, let's uh, let's go and get these fortuned up, see what we get. Apparently, people saying see how fast you can mine obsidian. It's four seconds for obsidian with haste, so keep that in mind. I don't think it's in range of my house, so I lose the haste as I get towards my house, which is fine, really. I'm just going to leave it there, maybe do a bit more mining down the line, maybe move it along, clear out a brand new area. That could be pretty cool. These guys, cactus, zombies, whatever, they can stay. All right, let's uh, go and find out what we're up to. Um... Okay. Actually, that could be a good idea. I could go and place a glass block there. While I'm away. It's a good way to get a stone as well. I used a fair bit of this up. Um, actually, I'm a, I'm a fool. I should have taken my fortune down there. Or just mine with fortune in the first place. Uh, actually, we can do two things at once here. So we can grab a fortune pickaxe from here. Do I want a brand new one? Yeah, that one's ripped regardless. I've got so many of them. Uh, let's see how much this is going to cost to repair. Throw that in. Ah, beautiful. Uh, seven levels we can fully repair. Is it worth seven? No, it's not. Let's take six. All right, there we go. So that's fixed up, ready to go again. That was nice and easy. Obviously, as you can see, we got way more than that was worth. So now let's uh, let's take this back over and uh, let's see how much stuff we got. All right, so you guys can play against me here. See you guys closer. I'm estimating 50, 57 diamonds. Uh, I'm going to write this in chat. 57 diamonds. I'm estimating uh, 124 redstone. Um, maybe 24 lapis. And um, L and iron doesn't matter, obviously. Why would I even do that? Why would I even bring it? I don't even need that. Oh, I forgot the one key thing. People said use glass. And that was the one thing I was going to forget. I wonder if anyone was going to go and investigate that. Um. <laughs> Classic Pete. Classic Pete. Right. Let's go and let's go and trial this. Let's go and trial it out. And then uh, once I've done that, I am I am unfortunately going to have to wrap up this episode. I would love to continue and do some villager stuff. However, um, I have to go and record some GTA Grand Theft Auto with. Uh, with the guys I record videos for on my other channel, The Sidemen. And uh, I wasn't actually going to stream until about two hours from now. But I was like, that's quite late. I was like, please guys, can I have permission to go and stream? And they're like, as long as you're not longer than 30 minutes. Um, so yeah, I need to make sure I'm not. Where is it? It's here? How have I lost it? How have I lost the beam? Vic, are you for real? Oh, there it is. It's down there. It's weird that they change in certain resolutions. There we go. Let's uh, drop that in there. I might even build the dirt back up just so someone could fall in there. Get rid of all the uh, creep explosions. And uh, we have the haste too in range. So it'd be cool to get a max beacon set up under my house. If I did like a beacon structure, if I did it so I could have six beacons. So the pyramid wouldn't have to increase that much because you can have multiple on one setup. If I had six beacons with all the abilities at my house, that would be so cool. I may actually set that up underground uh, near my house. So that's something for the future. But anyway, let's, uh, let's find out. The blocks even place faster? I don't even know. Let's make a tidal wave of diamonds. Look at me. I'm a reach. Um, there we go. Would you look at that? It's a, tide, it's, a tide, it's a staircase of diamond. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. That's the fortune. Ser seriously? Ser he just, I, no words. So derude. The rude creeper stomp. For some reason, in my mind, I didn't even think that would be a problem. It was a problem. I don't know how many that actually messed with. Either way, I'm just going to mine the rest of them now. Oh, my. That was very dude. Hey, diamonds are easy, though. Diamonds are easy. How are we doing? Oh, it looks like we're going to be close to my guess. Maybe a little over. Oh, I went for 57. It was 60. But we may have lost some there. What did you guys go for? Look at that. They're just out and about to get me. Jeez. Light on this area a bit. They're just patrolling the area. They're like, we heard there are diamonds to explode. 
Like, they would appear at that moment as well, just as I'm about to start mining the diamonds. Alright, so how much redstone would, do we guess? 124. Could you not? Could you not? That's it. I'll fortune you, bro. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. I pick you. Did they not even drop any gunpowder? I didn't. I thought they might drop more. Alright, this time, let's, uh, let's do a tower of redstone. I don't know why. For reasons I don't quite understand. Yeah, come blow me up now, creepers. Alright, here we go. It's not actually super fast with these. It's going to be way more. What am I, Who am I kidding? 124? Ah, it's going to be way more. Let's see. A few people in the stream said they guessed exactly 60, so well done. You are a winner today. Oh, it's way more than 122. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? It's uh, actually... It's, uh, oh, let's get it all before we do the final count. Like, now is not the time. We have haste up in the house. Die, you. I may even... I'm going to check this out when I get back to my house. I may even have my full house beacon, the beam, come through the heart and turn red. That's what I may have. Oh, wait, there's even more redstone down here. Okay, we got in total um, just under three stacks, so it would have been... Um, it's... That's... Uh, uh, brain when... It's 189. 189, and I guessed 124. That's not so good. And Lapis, oh, we still have to do that. 24. Nah, it's probably going to be more than that as well, isn't it? Let's see. Oh, jeez. Let the Lapis throw... F oh, my gosh. 89. Well, I was kind of close with diamonds. The rest. No, 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 sir. But anyway, back to the house we shall go. For now. And, uh, yeah, the amount of stuff I got with the, uh, the pickaxes then... I can pretty much get that entire amount by spending like three diamonds and like 40 emeralds. So that's good. Yeah, I could have replace this with red glass. Then all the way down underneath there, have a full six slotted beacon. Although actually, actually if it was six, I could do a four slotted beacon that came all the way through my house. That wouldn't actually work because, uh, wait, could you do six? One, two, three, four, five. You could do five in like a star shape. Mind you, I need a whole lot beacon, a whole load more of beacons before we can do that. So that's going to require a wither farm, a wither skull farm, killing some withers, all that good stuff. Um, but there we go. Added a solid, solid amount to our diamond count. There we go. Another six blocks and some more. Um, I'm going to leave, I'm going to put these together to make another two blocks and then three spare to go on the pile. So the rich manness increases. There we go, 15 diamond blocks. So that's nine a time. That's, how much is that? Is that 135? 135 plus 49 math at this time in the morning. Uh, wait, one, 135, um, what, 184. 184, I think that was right. I hope it was right. Um, but that is me done for today on this episode and stream of How to Minecraft. Going to head off, record some uh, GTA, then hopefully some more Minecraft on my Minecraft channel tonight. So for those of you that missed part of this stream, it will be on YouTube later tonight. Uh, make sure to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Twitch TV, and YouTube. Those are all of my favorite places to be. And uh, that is going to do for now. I'll see you all next time. Thank you and goodbye.